It's Filter Free Friday, y'all. <laughs> I'm glad y'all here. You see, I've been watching this movie, The Godfather of Harlem. It's about the story of Bumpy Johnson, and in it, his wife, Mimi Johnson, says something to him that I thought was incredibly profound. She said, I'm not so sure you can teach an old dog new tricks, but you can absolutely get a new dog with an old trick. Get a new dog with an old trick. Who has been able to withstand the entire system being against them? Who's been able to rise even when religious doctrine and systems were against them? Who's been able to rise when just because of who you are, the entire globe organized to enslave and in some ways kill and certainly break your spirit? Who's been able to rise when you couldn't gather, when you couldn't read, when you couldn't earn money and if you earned money, someone could take it and experience zero legal consequence because the entire legal system was against you. If you manage to find your way out of this situation at any point, someone with different skin could ask you to produce your papers and then you give them your papers. They tear your papers up and re-enslave you and your family. Your allies were few and far in between. You know, if we're going to talk about what's special about Black people, what makes us unique and different, I'm going to invite you not to align with the enemy, with this idea of supremacy based on skin. You see, if we're going to talk about what's good about Black people, you tell me who has been able to deal with an entire system not some parts of it. The entire globe, not some parts of it. Who have conspired against you. You see, the, the strategy has always been to distract, to dis divide, and to destroy. That's the consistent strategy. It's an old trick. And one of the ways that a people who weren't able to show their resilience or their rise up factor over the course of a couple years, over a couple decades, but for centuries, for hundreds of years, we have figured out how we could concentrate and unify and restore. And there wasn't a single time in our triumphant rise that we had 100% support from everybody. I would argue that there wasn't a single time that we had 50% of support from everybody. So if you want to tackle this new problem, look to the people who've been able to tackle it all. The entire globe conspired to kill us and could not. The entire globe George Frazier said it best. Your power is in collaboration, in coming together. The last thing you do is align with the ideals that suggest that there's something wrong with black skin. It's Filter Free Friday, y'all. We got work to do.